Greetings and hallucinations, ladies and lads. I am Chancellor of the Harmonious Frequencies of the Mighty Empire of Onion, and this is Rim World. We have the first part of the ship built, which is pretty exciting. Uh, we still have one more part that we need to finish researching and still have advanced components to get constructed in order to finish the thing. We were having a little bit of a food shortage last time. We're doing okay on meals right now. Uh, these berries are only about half grown, a little bit more. Some of these are about fully grown. They should be harvested soon. Some of these are pretty close, so not too bad. Uh, we didn't have any animals showing up for whatever reason. Sometimes it's just like that. Sometimes there's just not animals around. So we were forced to uh, slaughter a couple of alpacas in order to get enough food. I also marked a bunch of wild uh, plants. These agave, the berry bushes and stuff like that to be harvested around the map. Ugh. So inconvenient. Got three of them coming up. Well, let's just get everybody in here, I think. Makes things a little bit uh, complicated sometimes, but it's morning anyway, so everybody's got to get up and get going. You just come into right here. You guys should be able to hang out there. Tony might be able to get this one started, and Sarah could give him a little backup. Um... You four hang out right there. Not bad. Alright, who's Mercado is trying to go inside all of a sudden? Let's not let's not do that. This is a little bit worrying as well. Oh wow! Uh, dang it. Uh, Greyhound decided to use the back door. It's not really ideal. Cat's got the door held open. Oh, Greyhound, you crazy fool. Oh, he's down. In the doorway. Alright, we need to get this door open again so that we can provide some support here. Got one more. Okay, should be all set. Uh, everybody who has injuries, I would say go ahead and go do your own thing. Then we'll get the uninjured folks who are still up to come in and take care of these, these things. The hives. This is even more inconvenient because um, we're damaging... Damaging goods, I'm pretty sure, when we shoot at him like this. Alrighty. Alright, 
Animals just pushing us around. <laughs> Jerks. Go home, animals. I didn't actually want them to go over there. I was trying to uh, turn off that notification, but it ended itself. It's fine. Got some insect jelly, which is always kind of nice. Wild Boar 7 has been injured. Should be okay. Oh, is it set to be following people around, though? Yep. It's not trained for release yet, so I'm going to disable that. Alright. Get things ticking again. Uh, I guess I would like to see... what's required for these. We have the computer core, we've got the engine down. We're gonna need 15 advanced components more that. We'll get those going automatically. Alright. Unfortunately, it makes them unhappy to eat uh, insect meat, or food that's been made with insect meat. And so I'm not going to be able to allow that to be put into the meals, which is kind of sad. We have baby chickens, that's cool. Got an emu over here, that's good. Ah, muffalo coming in, excellent. You guys are gonna save our bacons. Another... oh no, that's our female mega sloth. Okay, Calbran and Tony are both healed. It's good. Oh yeah, put a back door in on the uh, stockpile, it'll be a great idea. Really convenient. Help everybody out. Poor Greyhound. Uh, I can't even... man. I didn't even see the line that said where he was walking going up through there, so that was super inconvenient. He's alright though. I don't remember us having anything going on in the world. Uh, I think we had a trade caravan request. Yeah, 450 elephant skins. We're not going to be able to fill that one. That's okay. That looks to be the only thing going on right now. We don't have the pemmican for a good caravan, so... Um, it's fine that there's nothing happening at the moment. Alright, some of these berry bushes are looking pretty good, I'd say. The elephants think so, and the megasloth. That's why they're over here eating all of them. Instead of all this hay grass down here. Good job, Boots. Way to take care of business. And he's not even he's not even a wimp anymore now that he has that pain stopper. He doesn't even worry about it. to 12 advanced components right now. That's pretty nice. Wooter is cooking some stuff though. There he goes. Now he's back on it. T 
ticking up the research pretty fast. I like that. I want to say we're probably going to have them sticking out this direction like this, and then have the Crypto Sleep caskets hanging off uh, the top and bottom. So let's try and get these set up a little bit. Oh, that has to be built before they're able to be attached. Five advanced components apiece. Man, these things have gotten expensive. They really made it a lot more difficult to get the ship built uh, in these later updates than it used to be. Which is understandable, I suppose, you know. It kind of is rocket science to get a uh, spaceship put together. It's a good way to tell if they're domestic animals or not, is to go around searching for them at night. Because if you have animal beds built, domesticated animals will use the beds. And so if there's something sneaking around asleep, not in a bed, it's probably a wild animal. A few rats sneaking around here and there. Not too bad. Boom rats as well. Fine. Oh, there is a hunt tool. Holy cow. So I could have been using this the whole time. Pro tip. If you want to hunt a bunch of stuff, just do the click and drag thing, like I did with the uh, plant harvesting. And I used to know these things. can't believe I forgot that stuff. Somebody's being attacked. Why are we slow all of a sudden? Yeah, nobody's injured. It must have been uh, an animal on fire or something, I don't know. Ostrich was trying to take revenge, but I guess it was uh, killed. It's still gone slow again, though. Not sure what's going on here. Heavy and Sir are having problems. The dog broke down. And that meat rots really fast in the regular stockpile, doesn't it? Holy cow. Alright. We have a respectable amount of meat in the cooler now. N4 is trying to starve for some reason. N4, why are you starving? Please. Please tell me. The... Restricted in some way? No. Got all this food here. All this stuff up here. I don't know if she can reach it, though. Have they eaten it? Yeah, they've eaten everything down here. There's a little bit of grass. Down the south area. I'm surprised they don't eat the agave. I'm glad that they don't, but I'm also surprised. Rooster 2 is starving now, too. Do they not eat? Uh... Do they not eat grass? Rooster 2, are you still starving? Yes, you are. Vegetables, seeds, live plants. Meals, processed foods, liquor, and kibble. Live plants. That should that should include these. These are up to 57% grown. These around here are about 40 and 60. So about 50%. 39. 58. These should be mature enough for them to eat, I would think. I guess if they were mature enough to eat, though... They would be eaten. Got a trade ship. Hi, Joe. I'm sorry, buddy. Wake up, please. 
before these guys get out of range. Exotic goods are always good. Oh, let's buy some chickens. No, we need to, uh, we need to not do that. These are the ones for sale anyway, so that's fine. Chinchillas? Are you kidding me? Yes, please. We have too many animals already, I'd say. Neutroamine? Are we out? It's not saying that we have any. Let's buy... What do you say, like a hundred? Buy at least... At least a hundred. Down to 15,000 silver somehow. Not, not sure how we spent so much. That's fine. Components. Uh, they're charging too much for them, though. Let's see. They have an arm. I don't think we need one. We've got two eyes. And an arm that I probably ought to designate for somebody. Sculptures and stuff like that. Doomsday rocket launcher. That would be fun, but I don't think so. Okay. That'll be fine. Oh, we did have some. 62 neutromine right there. That's alright, now we have 162. That's crazy that it can all stack into one stack. I thought the stack limit for everything was about... Oh. Stack limit for most items is 75. Like silver, maybe uranium. Gold. Is more. Oh no. Okay, there, it does, it does tell people. Should cut or burn the blighted plants before blight spreads. Okay. Yeah, we definitely want to do that because we've seen how that goes. The plant cutting is a high priority on everybody's list, so it should be gotten done pretty quickly. I keep forgetting about that squirrel being our... being ours. Okay. We are getting more Devil Strand in too, which is pretty important. Yes. Cut those plants. Do not let the blight spread. Alright. Good job. Good job, everybody. Save the day. What about these? Okay. Yeah, we got on top of that fast, so... Problem solved. I have a feeling that if the... fields are touching, they would probably spread all the way. So like these fields up here, if one of them caught it, it would spread all the way across. But since we have this gap in here, I don't think it spreads across there. I don't know for sure. It's just a theory. I'll have to test it out one of these days. Yeah, see now they're chowing down on these other plants. So we shouldn't have to worry at all about animal starvation anymore. Alright, Wooter. Man, just pick one thing. Stop trying to do everything. I swear. Making the place look trashy with your unfinished projects here. That's Mega Sloth Wool? Okay. It looks weird to me for some reason. I guess it looks exactly like the alpaca wool. It's a different color. But it looks really strange to me. Got a lot of alpaca wool. That's for sure. Did they get... Oh, look at it. Look at it. It's coming along. So good. Oh, I still can't believe there's advanced components in these crypto sleep caskets. So absurd.
questionable if we're going to be able to get everybody out of here. As expensive as it's gotten to build this stuff. Alright, so what is it? Six per? That's 30, 60 more advanced components. Whoa! Yeah, that's right. Crazy. I don't know where this cloth clothes came from. Because I don't think we've made anything out of cloth in a long time, but that's fine. If they want to wear this stuff, they can. That's right, Wooter. Get to it, buddy. How are we doing with gold again? 700. Not too bad. We had a meteorite. A gold meteorite crash not too long ago. So if we need gold, it is available. Here it is. There was also some that was naturally spawned right here. We're gonna need this for sure. More components. There's some more steel there. Some more plasteel as well. Nice. Oh, Marindil has joined. Beautiful. Good job, Marindil. Proud of you, buddy. I think you might like it here. Animal handling, we shouldn't need help on. Hunting. Instruction. There we go. And see what gun do we have for you. Could give him a... Uh, a chain gun. He's going for that shield belt already, as per usual. Um, here we go. Got a good LMG. Also a normal auto pistol there. Good job, Marindil. I guess equally it could be argued that his name is Mirandil. Mercado, you need to find something to do, buddy. Let's just kill everything, you know? I don't think that there should be a living thing on the map. Ever. There resources over here. Silver. Okay. There's a wall in here too. Which is super weird. Okay, that's all we can see of it so far. We can pull up the floors here too. Sure. We'll grab a couple of uh, resources off of that. Up, sir. Take him down. Get him. He's a dangerous, dangerous beast. Get him. We're down to 17 components, too, which is a little concerning. That's why I'm carving those out, I guess. Whoa! A rat is attacking after being harmed? Yeah. I don't see that very often. Ah, oh, purple meds. Very nice. Oh, muffalos. 
very nice. Holy cow. Prioritize the mufflos, please. Don't kill... Don't kill squirrels over mufflos, please. Got my caught up. Oh, look at them all. <laughs> we have a couple of hunters in our colony. Don't shoot each other. Come on. Be smart. Greyhound. Stop shooting Marindel. Muffalo revenge. They're angry, but they're not they're not attacking right now. Got some jade here as well. We can mine out. Sure. We'll get around to it. A lot of steel over here also. Is pretty convenient. I guess we could go ahead and just mine this gold out. Whenever we get around to it. I don't really have anything prior prioritized as number one for mining. We just need all of the resources. I guess it's possible that we could get everybody out of here. Uh, we might have to extend the ship a little bit further than it wants to be. But just one more arm uh, full of Crypt Sleep Casket should be enough. We'll be able to have everybody in there. Man, it's been a long series too. I'm ready. I'm ready for the ship to be built for us to get to space. That's going to have to be for another episode though. So if you want to catch the next episode, be sure to subscribe. Consider supporting my channel through the Patreon link down in the video description. And feel free to check out any of my other videos or playlists that you might be interested in. Thank you so much for all the time that you spend on my channel. And I hope blessings of wisdom and peace on all of you. Farewell.